let's go back in time when Trump first took office, when he took office and uh, it was he stepped into the White House in January of 2017 under a platform of drill, baby, drill. Now, what had happened leading up to that, what a lot of people forget is before he took office from 2014 to 20, uh, well, 2012 to 2016, we grew by two and a half million barrels a day uh, under the Obama administration. And then when Trump took office, there was a drill, baby, drill, and we're going to relax policies and whatnot. But if you look back at what the policies were, the key ones were offshore drilling expansion, public land access, drilling on public lands, and pipeline approvals, importing crude oil from Canada. Well, during Trump's presidency, we grew, uh, the U.S. grew by three to four million barrels a day of growth. That came from the Permian. It came from North Dakota. It came from Eagleford, Texas. There was nothing offshore, nothing from public lands. So as far as I'm concerned, from a policy perspective, there was nothing supporting uh, production growth in the United States from Trump's policies.